Here's a problem in which we have a toroid, and we want to find the magnetic field within the toroid for two different points. Two different radii, to be more exact. Now don't get hung up on the part that mentions the square cross-section. The formula doesn't change. The magnetic field within a toroid always follows the same formula, which states that it is equal to the magnetic constant times the current carried by the toroid times the number of turns divided by 2 pi times the radial distance that we're looking at. First, let's look at the inner radius. Capital N is just 500 turns, as given by the problem. I is also given by the problem, as 0.8 amperes. We also have the inner radius, which is given as 15 centimeters, or in SI units, that's 15 times 10 to the power of negative 2 meters. So if we plug all these into our calculator for this formula, and also bearing in mind that the magnetic constant is equal to 4 pi times 10 to the negative 7 tesla meters per ampere. And we plug all this into our calculator and find a magnetic field of 5.33 times 10 to the power of negative 4 teslas. So that's the magnetic field for the point at the inner radius of the torus. The problem also asks about the case for the outer radius. Now the problem doesn't give us the outer radius of the torus directly, but it's easy enough to figure out. Because we're given the inner radius, that would be the 15 centimeters that we just used, but the problem also gives us the side length of the torus itself as 5 centimeters. So that adds on to that. So the outer radius is just 20 centimeters, because we add that 5 centimeters to the 15 centimeters of the inner radius. So we'll just want to do exactly what we just did, except instead of using 15 times 10 to the negative 2 meters for r, instead we'll use 20 times 10 to the negative 2 meters. And if we do with that, then we find a magnetic field of about 4 times 10 to the power of negative 4 teslas. So that is the magnetic field for the outer radius, which answers both parts of the problem. So that's all for this video. I hope it helped you out. If you have any questions, please leave a comment down below. And if you want to support me in making future videos like this, consider subscribing and that'll help me out a lot. If you have any requests for future videos that you'd like me to make in particular, I have a Discord server linked down below where you can contact me and, and post suggestions for videos and I'll try to get to them. But that's all for now. And I hope you all have a lovely night. Bye-bye.